Hi, Lisa Evans here, Scotland and Arsenal forward. I thought today that we could have a look back at our vlogs from this season and pick our top five moments. So yeah, let's get cracking. I hope you guys have loved the vlogs as much as we have and thank you for all your support. Okay, let's go. Gonna put my headphones in. This should be a laugh. <laughs> Looking forward to this. Okay, so starting at Number five, Anna Patton prank. Uh, yeah, just loved having Patsy's involvement in general, to be honest, in the vlogs this year. I wanted to get Patsy Here we prank, go. but I don't know how to do it. Yeah, just, have, you seen that, have you seen that prank where you just start This is me and then, like, planning the prank. Like, I'm chatting through the Katie McCabe and like, Steph. Can stay. you feel? No, you can splash it. it. Yeah, but not on you. Okay, like. okay. Love this yeah, one. Patsy's always so happy nice. and good chat and good vibes, so. Yeah. Can you feel <laughs> <laughs> I feel so bad that I've done that to her because she's not expecting yeah. it. She's just about to run the yo-yo test as well, so that's not a I great, to get you for a great so prep for that. <laughs> she pranked me before, so I was generally just trying to get her back. <laughs> Four is the basketball tournament. The girls are always doing funny stuff before training, just like little challenges. Um, Beth cracks me up so much in this because she's absolutely pants. And then Kim's doing her skills as always. Skill school. But yeah, like I said, the girls are always doing little challenges before training. <laughs> Some of the girls are actually really decent at basketball. Patsy's really good. Lee Williamson looks like a bit of a baller. Yeah, sorry, but Beth is clearly on the side down. I don't know why she went last all the time and every time it was getting to her, it was just messing up. So I think we changed, they had a substitute and she went one of the first people and then it worked a lot better. <laughs> but yeah. And that's us all celebrating because we've just done it. Yeah. Okay, so clip number three, three, clip number three, we have Viv's 100th cap. That was pretty cool. Not so cool? 100th cap hairstyle. Cool. She's got her space buns in. That was off to a great start. Basically, the space buns was... Um, part of our favourite Netflix show that we were watching at that time and one of its favourite characters so we just thought like let's get the space buns out see see how it goes see how it looks I thought they looked class to be fair um, so yeah they were fun here's Viv getting her flowers from Joe <laughs> you need to score 9 goals today so it's 100 goals 100 games stunning stunning that's when the weather was good I mean it has been stunning. decent but now it's a bit rubbish but yeah, Bev getting her 100th cap was pretty cool. And she obviously didn't end up playing with the space buns in, which I was hugely disappointed at. But yeah, that was really cool and a massive achievement for Bev. So well done, Bev. So now we have clip number two, which I think is my favourite. Ah, almost my favourite. Um, the lockdown haircuts. They were hilarious. Um, we just got caught up in everything, just we were seeing it all online. I actually thought it was going to be way easier than it was. It was not easy at all. They've done a way better job than I did. I really messed her head up at the start, but it's so funny. I've still got a towel on my head. We were just watching a stupid YouTube video and just trying to do it like the woman. She was cutting her kid's hair. It was so funny. <laughs> Viv doesn't know what an inch is. Who doesn't know what an inch is? <laughs> Look at her face, she's frowning so much. She has no trust in me whatsoever. Still frowning by the way. Stop. Look at that, I've nailed that. I've absolutely nailed that. Are you kidding on? Oh yeah. No, yeah. No. <laughs> This is the bit where Viv realises that our hair is longer at the front than it is at the back, which isn't a great sign, so I had to fix that out a bit. That is normally quite even. She's nice about it, to be fair. from the back, so. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that needs to be fixed. <laughs> oh, See, so now she's buzzing. She 
He's absolutely buzzing. It's went from being a nightmare to being absolutely class. So yeah, she's chuffed, I'm chuffed, everyone's chuffed. And number one of this season has to be all the post-match celebrations. Cause yeah, there was just a period throughout the year that I think after Christmas, we had a bit of a down dip and we thought, okay, maybe not gonna get Champions League, but um, we just went on this mad winning streak and you can see that from all the post-match celebrations. Um, it was just like the hype and the, the buzz after the game and good times all around. Everyone's dancing, the music is delightful. Jill is always dancing. She's a good dancer, I'm gonna give her it, she is. Um, but yeah, so many games, so many dances, so many good tunes. Thanks Leah Williamson, cause she is DJ and she's class. Yeah, Jill Dore eating her pizza, definitely one of my favorite moments, <laughs> no doubt about it. <laughs> Um, yeah, we've got a fair amount of good dancers on the team. Lydia, questionable moves, but yeah, nah, it's always good fun after, after game vibes. People just are different after games. You just come in and you're off the pitch and you're buzzing and that's when you see people for who they truly are. Um, Viv's never in, involved in the dancing to be fair, but yeah, Patsy, Katie, Beth, Lydia, yeah, love a bit of dancing, Jill. Jill is dance queen, um, but yeah, it's always so much fun when we come back in, we're coming off the back of a victory, everyone's absolutely buzzing. And most definitely listen to High School Musical, so that's always cool. I enjoyed that way too much. So funny looking back on all the moments. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and comment your favorite bit below. Um, yeah, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Hopefully they're the same as mine, but if not, let me know. See you soon.